the mainstream media basically uh, reported <laughs> from the Mandela funeral one picture, or it it got a, sure. a little bit uh, carried out. But the the uh, Danish prime minister, the woman who took a, a selfie from herself uh, sitting next to Barack Obama and David Cameron. Uh, what else happened in the, the Mandela funeral? First of all, it was a rare opportunity to see them all in one place. You know, I saw Prince Charles walking out in the village in Uno in the ceremony, looking for someone to take care of him among the... And everyone came to him asking to be photoed with the iPhone. <laughs> <laughs> and he couldn't refuse <laughs> and and finally he found himself in a little car in the back seat with two other people sitting there <laughs> you saw that many of them as human beings i saw uh, sarkozy going down the stairs together with holland when Oland was still with his uh, love affair and his uh, 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 partner. I mean, you see them for so close. Uh, there were very rare opportunities in history when all the real celebrities of the world were there. And I was just thinking, if a bomb would have fallen on the stadium in Johannesburg, God forbid, Would we have a better world or a worse world <laughs> without all those people who were sitting there? <laughs> okay. This is a typical sort of uh, well, Israeli, well, uh, by the Just way. one more thing. What is your conclusion? Sure. Uh, is it or is it not a better? Uh, let's try it and see. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Asenne on rock. Radio Rock.